at this studio, filled with glamorous prizes, fabulous and exciting merchandise, including this, keep the family entertained in this $14,000 TV room showcase. Enjoy the exotic Orient on this one-week Hong Kong adventure. And a small wonder, this $10,000 Dodge Colt premiere. Over $101,000 just waiting to be won on Wheel of Fortune. And now, here's your host, Pat Sajak. Now, la -la, Thank you. Thanks, Jack. Thank you all very much, and welcome again to Wheel of Fortune. Uh, a big burst of applause, please, uh, for our hostess here is Vanna White. Uh, come on, Vanna. And we are now going to say hello to the three people who will be participating in the festivities here. This is Marianne Manueli. They yes. tell me that's the way you say your name. Is that that's the way you say it? That's the way it? you say it. Good. From San Bruno, California. Mm -hmm. It says, now wait a minute, it says here you have eight children and eight grandchildren. That's I cheated. What I married it? into it. Oh, okay. Now, I knew there was something wrong with that, but now I... Look pretty good, huh? <laughs> I was impressed, Graham. I really was. Uh, but and I one still more, am. one more grandchild on the way, too. Well, terrific. Number nine. Uh, congratulations uh, to whomever is involved in that uh, stuff. Thank you. Uh, Marianne enjoys photography, art, and uh, exercising. Mm -hmm. Good luck to you. Thank you. Uh, Rose Sumlin, how are you, Rose? Fine, thank you. How are you? I'm just fine, too. A claims examiner for an insurance company. Yes. Must be interesting work. <laughs> Is it interesting? Long days. Long days. Well, that can be interesting, too. Mm -hmm. uh, you do a little singing? A lot of singing. Yeah, but mm -hmm. uh, professionally at all? Not yet. Yeah, but you'd like to, huh? Yes. Okay, that wouldn't be boring, would it? No, no. Okay, nice to have you here, Rose. Good nice luck to, to you. Here. Thank Here's you. Mike Rogers uh, from Walnut Creek, California. What do you do up Walnut Creek, Mike? Hello, Pat. I'm a computer consultant. Mm -hmm. Your family? Uh, I have a family, yes. One, one small boy, 16 months old. Okay, and uh, you play some soccer, it says? Uh, yeah, I try at my age. And the piano. True. Good. You ready to play our game? Very much. Let's do it. $1,000, top dollar value for this round. Try not to get bankrupt. If you do, you lose your cash but not your merchandise because... Once you buy a prize, it's yours to keep. Our first puzzle is a person. And uh, let's see, a couple of things I have to tell you. First of all, there is a hyphen in this person. And let me also remind you that person does not always mean proper name. Okay, remember that, folks. Just before the show, we drew numbers to see who would start it. Here's Marianne. Thank you. Oh, Come on. Whoa. Just barely. 750. I'd like an R, please. Uh, there is one R, and it's right there. Wait, can I? Big money, $800? Look at that. I'd like an S, as in Sam. There are two S's, wow. Sure. The good one, 700. Okay. I'd like an N as in Nancy. Is there an N? I don't think so. I'm sorry. Rose. Come on, 1,000, 1,000. 450. Is there a T, please? Yes, ma'am. There are two T's. You have $900. There they are. I'll spin. Sure. Come on, 500. Is there an L? Mm-hmm. There it is. Now, you have $1,100. I'll spin. Come on, 1,000. $150. How about an M? Mm, that we don't have. Nope. Sorry. Mike. I'll spin. Come on, Mike. <laughs> Um, I'd like a C, please. Uh, give him a C, and you have some money now. Oh, good, good. 800. Um, I'd like an H, please. Why, there are some H's coming up. Look at this. One, two, three, four H's. Mike, you have $3,400. What's it going to be? Um, I'll spin. Okay, good luck. Right. 
150. Uh, I would like a W, please. Mm-hmm. And that is, let's see, 3550. What do you want to do? I think I'll solve the puzzle. All right, it's a lot of money. Uh, identify this person. High school sweetheart. You said it. Very nice. <laughs> High school sweetheart. $3,550 to spend in the TV room, so go to it. Okay, for eight fifty, I'd like the gold loop earrings. Okay, and you still have twenty-eight hundred, rather twenty-seven hundred dollars to spend. Uh, for four ninety-five, the portable electric keyboard. Okay, you're not finished yet. It's still over twenty-two hundred dollars. Okay, for three forty, the floor lamp. Well, that goes to you, and you still have more than eighteen hundred to go. Um, for fourteen ninety-five, the stereo massage chair. All right, and uh, that leaves you with three seventy. Uh, for 232, the Greyhound, please. Okay, that's that's an actual bus you get. $138. Uh, we'll go either on a gift certificate or on a phone. I'd like it on a gift certificate. Please. That's where we'll put it. I was just kidding. It's a dog, isn't it, Jack? <laughs> yes, it leaves the driving to me, Mike. Well, first of all, we start with this. It's graceful in its movements. The Greyhound dates back to ancient Egypt, an exacting life-size reproduction in ceramic composition, $232. And then clover lamps, umbrellas of light, floral lamp, magnificent imported opal glass with high-fired gold accents, brass finished and baked lacquered, designed to create a shower of light from Clover Lamp Company, $340. Then the PCS 500 play card portable electronic keyboard from Yamaha can make you a musician on the first day. Perform your favorite music with the play card system from Yamaha, $495. Next, with your Van Cleef and Arpels gift certificate, you might select these handsome 18 karat gold large oval loop earrings for your lady, enhanced with swirl texturing, $850. And finally, the getaway chair, computerized massage lounger, built-in AM FM stereo cassette with wrap-around speakers designed for total relaxation from HWE Incorporated, $1,495. You could vacation in that chair. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's a nice first round total. We'll be back with our second round right after these messages. My back. Nice to get the first one out of the way. Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> Upgrade to date? Well, we've got the cure. Choose me and I'll set you free. Tonight, 10.30 Eastern, 7.30 Pacific. All right, second round, we still have a $1,000 space on the wheel. We've added a nice prize to it. It says sculpture. It's a nice sculpture. That's the four cheaters, isn't it, Jack? I believe it is, Pat. Yes, it's the House of Lorenz presents this limited edition Italian Capodimonte porcelain sculpture, and it is the four cheaters. It's numbered and signed by the artist by Forest Lamps and Gifts. Retail value, $1,590, Patrick. Okay, thank you. Plays the land on that prize will go in your bank, and of course, if you solve the puzzle, that uh, sculpture will be yours, and that's uh, worth almost $1,600. That could go a long way toward deciding a match around here. I want to remind you we have another bankrupt on the wheel, and our next puzzle is a thing. And Rose, we start second round with you. Okay. Rose? No, hang on. That's the arrow right in front of you. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, okay. yeah. Mike, it means it's your turn. Two fifty. Uh, I'll take a T, please. No, you won't. Sorry, no T. Marianne. Okay, come on, sculpture. Come on, sculpture. <laughs> Two fifty. Okay, I'd like an R. Uh, yeah, there's one R. Did you just curse our wheel? I thought you were... <laughs> put a little hex on it. Go ahead. Yeah, you did. Pick that up. Put it right in front of you. That's a... Uh, hey, this is heavy kind of. Wait a minute. All right. Thank you. That'll be yours if you end up solving the puzzle. Now, $150 is the amount we have under there. Pick a letter. I'd like an N. Uh, I think we have some Ns. Two of them, yes. Ooh. All right. You're up to $550 plus that sculpture, Marianne. Mmm, 600. How 
How about a D as in David? There is a D, yeah. Okay. You have 1150. All right. Two fifty. Um, an L is in Larry. No, I'm sorry, there's no L. Hang on there, Rose. Now, Rose, hold it right there. <laughs> I know, five hundred. Is there a J? Well, after all that, there is no J. Mike. Okay, I'll spin. Can you do it? Not quite. 200. I'll try an S. Uh, two of them. That's worth $400. I'll spin. Sure. Uh, two hundred. Uh, $450. Okay, I'll try uh, a G. There is no G. Marianne, back to you. Okay, here we go. How about $700? Okay. Yep. I'd like a P, please. Yes, ma'am. There are two P's. Now, Marianne, you have that sculpture sitting there along with $2,550. What are you going to do? I'm going to solve puzzles. Please do. Sunday newspaper. You did it. <laughs> you wanted that sculpture, didn't you? You wanted the four cheaters, and you've got them. That's worth fifteen ninety, and you have twenty five fifty to spend in the His Hair Boutique. Oh. What do you like? Okay, I'd like the onyx and gold ring. How much is that? Oh, I'm sorry, for one thousand five hundred and seventy five dollars. Okay, the ring, and that takes you down to oh, let's figure it out here, nine something, seventy five, nine seventy five. Okay, for eight hundred dollars, the lamb jacket. Okay, one seventy five. And I'd like for seventy dollars the Gucci bracelet. Okay, one hundred and five dollars to go. A gift certificate around account. Gift certificate, please. That's where it'll go, and you just smile, and Jack will tell you all the good news. I sure will, Pat. Mary Ann, we start with Gucci's skin and gold bracelets. They're designed to be worn by either sex, and they come in a wide variety of colors and look good when mixed. Seventy dollars, and then cuddly and warm. This curly lamb reversible jacket may also be worn as a windbreaker with the lamb inside next to your body. Uh, from Fun With Furs, this jacket is $800. And finally, you'll receive a Tiffany gift certificate with which you might choose this man's 18 karat gold ring with very large round black onyx center. It's $1,575. Terrific. And when you add in the, uh, what was that? Oh, sculpture, yes. $4,140 that round was worth to you, so it's a good tight match going, and we'll be back with round three with $5,000 on the wheel right after this word. Thanks, Shirley. You know, Tony. Third round, a bunch of money on the wheel, including that $5,000 space. Phrase is the category this time. Third round means third player will start. Mike. Eight hundred. Uh, a T, please. Good news. Four T's. Wow. Nice. And just like that, you have thirty-two hundred dollars. I think I'll buy a vowel. No good idea. Uh, o, please. Uh, just one, but that uh, keeps it going. You still have a lot of money left. Um, I think I'll spin. Okay. I'd like an N, please. Is there an N? There is. Yes. Now you have forty-four fifty sitting in front of you. I'll buy another vowel. Okay. I'd like to buy an I. Mike, I'm sorry, that one got you. There's no I. We may get back there. Marianne. Okay. I don't know. A little too much. A little too strong. Rose. What, uh, 
What letter would you like? Is there a G? No. Oh. Mike, I'm going to spin it. Come on, come on. You're hitting some nice numbers here, and you've done it again with 800. Okay. Um, is there an S, please? Yes, there are two S's. Now, listen to this. You're up to $5,800. I'd like to buy a vowel. All right. An A, please. That we do have. In fact, two A's. Okay. I'd like to solve the puzzle. For $5,550, what's the phrase? Last but not least. Yes, that's it. Fine job. Last but not least, uh, boy, that's a lot of money. Over $5,500, you're going to spend that in the travel extravaganza area. What uh, tickles your fancy? Wonderful. Uh, for $4,334, I'd like the Hong Kong trip, please. Tickles mine, too. And you still have over $1,100, uh, 1216 actually, to go. $1,216. Mm -hmm. um, for $300, I'd like the binoculars. That would be 916 And, um... For $778, I'd like the his and her luggage. Okay, it's kind of a theme has developed on this shopping spree. $138 to go, gift certificate for you again, and yes. some pretty spectacular prizes. Jack Clark will tell you all about them. I sure will, Pat. Well, Mike, we start with Bausch & Lomb binoculars. One of the first names in sports optics, waterproof, fogproof, and center focus, enables you to get closer to the action from Bushnell, retail value $300. Rugged nylon outdoor twist fabric featuring new coffee brown, expandable capacity from Skyway, $778. And finally, it's a trip to Hong Kong. Now, we'll fly you and a guest from Los Angeles for a week's stay at the Golden Mile Holiday Inn Hong Kong, a first-class hotel on exciting and bustling Nathan Road, right in the middle of all the shopping, nightlife, and entertainment that the exotic Orient can offer. Retail value, $4,334. I'll be back to chat with you in uh, just a moment. Rose, I wish I had some better news for you, okay, but uh, okay. I do have some parting gifts. Uh, not me personally, but I think the show will give them to you. Uh, okay. I have nothing for you, actually. I have some shoes. Uh, well, no, anyway, <laughs> congratulations. Thanks Thank for being you. here. Sometimes Thank I get caught up in these things. I don't know what I'm saying. Marianne, hi. $4,140 in prizes for you. And your sculptures, you good in that. Thanks for being here. That was great. Thank Eight you. grandchildren, indeed. Uh, <laughs> Mike, excuse me. Now, uh, uh, Mike, $9,100 in prizes. Congratulations on that. Thank you. Well, I'm about talked out. We'll be back for the bonus round in just a second. Good work. Children, I found it, tell, tell, I found it interesting by your, your own experience. Well, um, we've just had a little boy, and it was the 13th grandchild for my uh, mother-in-law, and it was their first boy. Twelve. All the rest were girls. Yeah. That's pretty good. I don't know what they were. You're from England. Uh, uh, originally, just yes. want to point yeah. that out for people who didn't get that. Well, thank you, and goodbye, everyone. Thank you for joining. <laughs> oh, we should play the bonus round. What do you want to go for? Um, I'm going for the diamond pendant. Ah, that's more than an afterthought. Here's Jack. I should say, Pat. Well, Mike, solve the puzzle, and you might choose this pendant with your Tiffany gift certificate. A large 36-carat pear-shaped amethyst trimmed with diamonds. It's suspended from an 18-carat gold chain. $7,900. Good luck. Okay, we're all pulling for you, looking for a thing this time. Mike, give us five consonants and one vowel. Uh, a T. It's one. An N. Two. An L. Three. An S. Four. And an R. Five. And your vowel. And an E. Okay, Mike looking over the used letter board to help him out if you wonder what he was staring at there. And now Vanna's going to tell you how many letters you managed to find, or show you anyway. All right, you can do it. It's a thing. You have 15 seconds to work it out. Good luck. Time, time, hold, something time, something time, foil, foil tone, 
Boy, you were Sorry. Toward the end, you were on the trail. It wasn't something tying, it was something toned. Dial tone. Dial tone oh. is what it was. He needed a few more seconds, I think, to work on well, that. Well, I had a great time. Wait, and you did terrific. Very well. $9,100. Pretty good haul any half hour, I would say. Thanks for being here. Thank you very much, Tom. We'll be right back. One question. Well, because this is my birthstone. Oh, is it? And it is around my neck. What is that? I don't understand. Hint, hint. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody listening? No, no, that's, yeah, that's, that's, that very, that's very lovely. Is that heavy? Yeah, it is heavy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is fairly heavy. Listen, we thank you for uh, being here, Amethyst. And uh, we'll see you next time on Wheel, Wheel of Fortune. Fortune. So long. <laughs> Bye-bye. Some contestants who received a gift certificate from American Express merchandise service. <laughs> Upgrade to date? Well, we've got the cure. Choose me and I'll set you free. Tonight, 10.30 Eastern, 7.30 Pacific. I've got a fresh secret. You can... Up next on Game Show Network, play Jeopardy! Followed by Family Feud and Tic-Tac-Doe. Oh, and have been rounded off to the nearest dollar. Gift certificates do not include sales tax. is produced by Merv Griffin Enterprises, distributed by Columbia TriStar Television.